our largest project that 1040i does. We do, uh, depending on the volunteer support that we have, we do everything from um, surgeries. We, the last six years consistently, we've done orthopedic surgery, uh, general surgery, maxillofacial, and um, GYN surgery. Uh, if we have the doctors available and volunteer, we can do clinics as well. So this year, we've, in addition to the ORs, we've ran uh, two general medicine clinics and a women's clinic. The need continues, and as long as the need continues, 1040i will continue to be here. The 1040 Initiative is an organization, a nonprofit organization, focusing specifically on water, health, and education. And in this area of the Ivory Coast, the northeast corner, all three of these aspects that we focus on are in dire need. Water is really hard to find, and when you do find it, it's contaminated. And so one of the things that we do, we come alongside and we provide a purification system so that they can have pure water. Well, you need pure water to stay healthy, but sometimes you're unhealthy. And so 1040i focuses on some specialties that absolutely do not exist, nor have they ever existed in this area of the country. And we're also focusing on education. We know that education is the weapon by which you can dig out of poverty. The area continues to grow and develop. And you know, like the healthcare at home and, and the people at home, you have illnesses and things that come up. You have broken bones that you go to the hospital and fix and, and the patients here wait years sometimes before they are able to get a broken bone fixed or, or a hernia fixed. And so having the people come up to you, especially in the last couple of days where they're tugging on your shoulders or pulling on your clothes, just begging for you to help them and have to look them in the eye and tell them there's nothing you can do this time and to try again next year and hope that they get here in time to be able to get to the front of the line and get that help.